Good afternoon, everyone. Today we have with us Dipendra Sharma sir, the HOD of Math Department from Sri Ravatpura Sarkari University. How are you, sir? Uh, good afternoon, Rohan, and good afternoon all of you. I'm fine. Okay, sir. So shall we start with the questions, sir? Yeah. Okay. My first question to you: You held a key position at the Educational Institute throughout your professional career. What keeps you connected with the education sector, and how was your experience with the institute? Yeah, Rohan. Uh, I am in the teaching uh, sector uh, since 2006, and since then uh, I am continuing uh, my uh, services in this sector. And the reason behind this is uh, here we uh, get the opportunity to meet the uh, youth, and here we don't just teach the students, but also uh, apart from the teaching, we can upskilling or learn the current trends in the education sector. So this is the one of the reason uh, being in this uh, sector. Okay, sir. My next question to you: Being the HOD of Maths Department, Sri Ravatpura Sarkari University. what are your roles and responsibility towards the students uh being the head of department uh, at the private university the key responsibility is the uh, preparing the curriculum to meet the uh, challenges of the current scenario the uh, current scenario means the uh, demands of the uh, industries so here uh, our focus is to prepare the curriculum according to the uh, requirement of the industries and uh, apart from the academics uh, we try to shape our students uh, to uh, become a better human being okay. because uh, as per my opinion the teacher uh, is not only uh, <coughs> make the carry uh, guide the students through in uh, the academics only apart from the academics the teacher imparts the knowledge and good values uh, to the students and uh, brief the uh, challenges of the modern days and uh, also uh, um, uh, give, uh, give them the suggestions to resolve the challenges of the current scenario okay sir how does the curriculum of sri ravatpura sarkari university ensures that the students are being prepared for their future yeah the curriculum of the uh, ravatpura sarkari university is closely observed by the members of the board of studies and uh, time to time we are having the meetings of the board of studies and uh, further we can take the uh, measures to uh, update the curriculum according to the demand and uh, apart from that uh, we have also implemented the uh, measures uh, suggested in the new education policy so we are also working on the new education policy and uh, we uh, hope that uh, from the coming semester uh, will implement the uh, curriculum of the new education policy okay sir what are the biggest challenges you see for the both higher education in general and for ravatpura sarkari university specifically what are the challenges that the student will face when they come to the higher education uh, when we come to the higher education the biggest challenges right now uh, we are uh, dealing with the situation uh, under the covid yes. so the most uh, biggest challenge Uh, which i have observed is the uh, uh, the poor infrastructure like uh, at the university level we are having the infrastructure but uh, there are many government universities and the students also they are not having the uh, smartphones and if they are having the smartphones uh, they are facing the problems regarding the uh, network connectivity so we are uh, facing uh, troubles uh, during the online teachings so uh, and and uh, the online education is the demand of the time okay uh, because i have attended some uh, uh, conference i think 8 uh, years back uh, where the presenter uh, gave the concept of the online education and according to him uh, by 2025 the buildings and uh, uh, the physical laboratories uh, no one will visit the this physical infrastructure we have to uh, uh, convert into blended mode and here in this way we have to uh, create the infrastructure infrastructure in such day uh, in such a way and apart from that uh, the quality uh, means there are lots of the universities are there and uh, being the uh, part of the university i request all of uh, the universities that the quality uh demand 
and uh, with the help of the quality education only the students meet the challenges of the today's scenario okay sir my last question to you you would like to say anything about the to the aspiring students or not okay uh, my only suggestion is that there is no shortcut of the success the hard work hard work hard work is the uh, way of success only so this is the my message to the youth thank you okay sir thank you so much it was nice having you thank you so much thank for you. your patience sir